Sexy Lore. I'm here with Mackenzie Moss. Spiegler girl, brand new. Mm -hmm. You're cute and blonde. <laughs> Sorry. I have a thing for that. Oh. I'm a narcissist, I think. I think. <laughs> I don't know if that's why. And mm. you're vegan. I am vegan. Yes. So we're going to make <laughs> vegan stuff today. We're making sushi, and I've never made sushi before. Yeah, I don't think I have either. It sounds too hard. That's why I've never done it. But that's why we're doing it today. It'll be fun. Yeah. And we have a, a, a whole lot of questions. We have one, <laughs> two, three, four, five, six questions from you guys on Instagram because mm -hmm. your questions fucking suck. <laughs> so we're only going to be answering these and we're going to put them in our Whole Foods bag. There's a receipt. <laughs> we don't need that. They're in the bag. <laughs> As you can tell by me putting them in the bag. I will put the recipe in the description below because I don't think anybody here is going to watch this video and be like, oh, I know how to make that now. <laughs> you bring rice to a boil, boil, and then once it starts to boil, you turn it down, and then you put the lid on and it steams yeah. for a long time. For 20 minutes. Okay. Okay, we can Let's do that. Let's do that. I just remembered how to make rice. Dude, that was good. How much water should I put in this? Oh, yeah, you're right. Mix two and a half cups cooked rice. Sort and rinse rice before cooking. Combine one cup of rice with a cup and a fourth cup of water. <laughs> that is so specific. I know, but it makes it the exact right amount. No yeah, idea what we're doing. We're the worst at cooking. <laughs> we already fucked up step one. We already fucked up. Because <laughs> it said rinse the, it said I know. rinse the rice, though. So, it did say rinse the so rice. So just dump out the water that you rinse and then put the right amount. This is telling you how to make the whole bag. There's no way it's telling you not oh, to. Oh, okay. okay. Okay, okay. Rinse the rice. We got a cup and a fourth of water. <laughs> Hell yeah. And this is how you make rice. <laughs> it's funny. And then we're gonna bring it to a boil, you guys. You cut yourself. I will I will mix uh the spices. Um I just need a um cutting board and something to cut with. Where would you keep cutting this? Cutting board. Do you not want a cutting board? I can cut it on <laughs> A baking sheet. Baking sheet. That's what I was gonna say. Turkey sheet. It just looks really ugly, but um, I could do it this way. That looks still ugly, but <laughs> I got it on Amazon yeah. like six months ago. I do. Wait. I think we're weird, wait, but wait. Is this a cutting board? No, that's a cutting board. That's fine. That's better than nothing. <laughs> All right. First question. 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 Why do you have so many Pornhub followers? I don't! I'm a YouTuber, I don't know. Why do I have Pornhub followers? Mm. What's wrong with you guys? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> What's wrong with you guys, huh? <laughs> I, I'm, I'm not in porn. porn. Oh, motherfucker, I need a little measuring thing. You don't have them? <laughs> Isn't um, a spoon like one tablespoon? A tablespoon, I think. Man, I also don't have regular spoons. <laughs> Oh my god! I'm a fucking hippie. I only have bamboo. I hate regular spoons. I can only because it ruins the taste. I only like bamboo. Should I just use it? Maybe. This up? Maybe. I don't know. God damn it! What are you looking at me for? Huh, punk? <laughs> <laughs> you oh, sorry. Never sucked a stranger's <laughs> dick for money, and it shows. That's my phone background. This is very long. Come. <laughs> Isaiah Maxwell's cock. Oh. It's like long. Mm -hmm. We're the house healthiest vegans ever. It's not coming out. In case you cut yourself, yeah. I want to make sure we get it on. Thank you! <laughs> Spiegler will sue me. Yeah, queen. Probably. Try to deny it. <laughs> what did Spiegler say about us uh, cooking sushi? Well, first of all, he said it's not cooking. And you're not making sushi. Yeah. I and don't we don't know what to call it now. Making sushi? No. It's something else. It's something else. Siegler said it's something else. <laughs> so it is. I feel like someone in the comments is going to critique how I am cutting. Wait, how much are you putting in there? Two tablespoons is what it says. Okay, maybe Isn't a little less like than that. It sounds like a lot, right? Pat it down. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> And this sushi needs more sugar. I feel like we're not gonna say that. That was two tablespoons of sugar, and now we need 
one teaspoon of salt, which just sounds backwards, but okay. So a teaspoon is just a little bit. Right? Yeah. It's definitely less than a tablespoon, but... It's definitely less than a tablespoon. That's correct. This much? Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> this is how we cook. Fuck, we didn't start the timer. Oh, fuck. Oh, motherfucker. Best cooking memory. My best cooking memory. When I was 15, my first date with this guy was at my grandparents' house, and we made mashed potatoes together. <laughs> <laughs> I just found and it then, hilarious it was your grandparents' house. I live with my grandparents because my parents were not functional. Oh, I see. So, that was our first date together. My grandparents weren't very happy that we were making the mashed potatoes because obviously they paid for the ingredients and they were going to make it. <laughs> but I was trying to be romantic, <laughs> so we made it together. And it sucked. Oh. <laughs> but it was still really romantic. And we, like, I fed it to each you other. You did not. <laughs> we did. Oh, my God. It was a YouTube video, too. I'm oh, not kidding. This is how it started. It was very cute. It's so cute having your first date on film. Yeah. Because it's, like, maybe it was weird back then. I don't know if it was. Maybe that is a weird thing to do on a first date. I don't care. Because, like, I just get to watch it. And it's, like, cute. Whatever. Yeah. <laughs> but other people are like deleting all the old pictures, like throwing away the clothes and the yeah yeah. This is Add good. the cooked rice to a large bowl, which I don't have. <laughs> so I'm gonna use the pot. Ew, it looks so gross. <laughs> yeah. it smells like fucking piss, man. No, it doesn't. Yeah. I have linoleum flooring, so dirt gets stuck in the cracks. So I. Someone told me to put vinegar on the ground yeah. and then like squeegee it or whatever. And yeah. it, it helps a little bit, but like not really. Like my floors are always just a little bit dirty. I see. So my yeah. grandparents had a dog and like a yard and whatever. Mm -hmm. And we get fleas really bad. So apparently if you put vinegar in a bowl, yeah. the fleas jump in it. Yeah, that makes sense. So I just have the worst memories associated with vinegar in the world. Oh, yay. Mm -mm, it's not done. Okay. It's like kind of hot, but you're like a real vegan. Oh my gosh! Like you know about tofu, and I'm I just like know. I knew I'm gonna make tofu scramble, but I I've know never tofu I've never made tofu with anyone before, and I just feel like it's a very vegan thing. And yeah. Like, it's like very <laughs> like I feel some type of way about it. You're cute. <laughs> oh man. Oh, this is so cute. Stop. <laughs> My friend told me about <laughs> Oh yeah, your friend, huh? <laughs> you said your your friend twice. Oh damn, wait, okay. I was like, is it, are they my friend? Are they my friend? <laughs> that's what I was afraid of doing, so that's why I wanted to do press. It. <laughs> but it's like I don't know if it's okay that it did that. I guess it is, right? I don't know. We're supposed to cut it into strips. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I, I have I have faith in us. <laughs> Is there a special way that you cut an avocado? Maybe you do it different than I do. No, I do it Have like you ever that. heard of avocado finger? Excuse me? <laughs> Apparently, like, avocado is, like, getting popular or something. Yeah. And people like avocado, so there's right. this thing called avocado finger or avocado hand. I can't remember. Okay. And it's where you go to the hospital because you cut yourself <laughs> cutting an avocado. Oh, my God. I hate everything. It's a common thing now. How do you get the pit? Like that? Mm. Did that turn you on? Stop. <laughs> Am I even vegan enough for you? Yes. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> you like the way I eat the avocado off the pit? Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> you should get a regular spoon though, just to have. <laughs> Fuck you. What? I actually told my roommates when I had them, uh -huh. don't bring home regular. What? I told what? them, don't do it because not only do I not like using them myself, I don't like listening to other people <laughs> scrape their teeth on the spoon. Like some of it's regular rice and some of it's hard. What was your favorite food growing up? Um, growing up, I think 
feel like I ate a lot of like in like chicken nuggets in the oven and fries. I feel bad. I ate a lot of like pizza rolls, but remember we were filming this video and we asked you guys on Instagram, do you want us to make lasagna or vegan sushi? But growing up, my favorite dish was lasagna. <laughs> oh, so that's cute. But we're making sushi. Um, I feel like I really liked mac and cheese growing up too. Me too. Chicken and dumplings. I liked the dumplings though the best. That was like the only part I actually liked. <laughs> I like carbs. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, not some rice. Did you hear that sizzle? I mix our liquid into the rice, right? I'm a little scared too. <laughs> That's like the worst thing about this. No. What is it? There's so even... much rice. See, we didn't we didn't look at how much rice it wanted us to make. It was two cups. Oh, we're stupid. <laughs> oh so we have to double. We Come have to not double. Um, we not double, but you want to look at the rice again? Uh, I think it's. T uh, wait, there's. I think it's um, two. Oh, it's a, it's a little over two cups. It's like two, two and a quarter. It cups. makes. Two and a half cups of cooked rice. Okay, so, so it's this close. is two and a half cups of rice. How much does it want? Two cups. Hmm. But it looks like we did absolutely nothing to it. <laughs> so. <laughs> just mix it. We'll and just taste it and be like. Mm -hmm. I feel like. I feel like. But it also fine. is the consistency for the rolling, right? Isn't that another reason why we probably put maybe. Like shit in it? Like sugar, maybe? And I, don't know. I feel like. Yeah, see, so you didn't have enough water because at the bottom the rice is like sticking oh, to it. So yeah. it that'll do it. Right about that. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. It smells kind of like shit because of the vinegar. I hate vinegar. That's why I, I was like, maybe don't add more. Yeah. Because I'll be triggered. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm just destroying them. That's why I didn't want to do it. I wanted you to do it. <laughs> Wow. What's the best benefit of being vegan? It just makes you want to say every reason, you know? Like, it's hard to pick just one. Yeah. I mean, I feel like I originally became vegan uh, because I really loved animals. And I was horrified when I found out yeah. about that type of stuff. Because I, I became vegan in, like, middle school. So, like... I mean, growing up, like, at some point, you, you realize, like, it's an animal yeah. on your plate, but it's weird, like, at what point do we just, like, switch over and think it's okay? I don't know. I don't know either. For me, I specifically remember telling my parents, like, but this was a cow, and I remember they said to me, but cows are the dumbest animals oh, on the planet. Oh, damn. I'm not joking. <laughs> They're like, they're the dumbest animals on the planet. Oh my god. Like, they were put here for us to eat. I'm just like... Yeah. Just like very distraught about it, I guess. No, totally. So, but yeah, you're like conditioned into it. And you mm -hmm. don't see the animal being killed usually, so it's like... Right. You kind of detach from it. So like, just regaining that consciousness. and Because you just get it, and it's like in this nice little package, and you just cook it, and you can eat it, and... Mm -hmm. But it's it's more complex than that. Mm -hmm. yeah. Like for me, I went vegan because all the reasons is the Gary Yovsky speech. You know about it? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, I watched that, about. and you know he talks about like the planet. He talks about the animals. Talks about the health benefits. Yeah. So, for me, it was just everything at once. It was very overwhelming. Mm -hmm. and I remember I, uh, my dad made me chicken that night, fried chicken. Oh man. I tried to eat it because like I'm hungry. Like I don't know. Right. You know, it's hard to be vegan all of a sudden, overnight, but that's what yeah, I did. Totally. But I, like, couldn't eat the chicken. I, like, picked the skin off it and tried to eat it. Oh, it was, God. <laughs> it was just traumatizing. I didn't know what to eat. That is traumatizing. Right? Oh, yeah. No. So, but I just went vegan, like, ASAP. Yeah. I'm, like, mystified by this. I know. Do you know how to roll a blunt? I always make other people do it for me. Same. <laughs> just fucking pretty girl privilege, man. I know. I'm so I I I'm like self conscious about it because I want to know how to, but it's just I'm always too. like I feel like it'd be satisfying. Yeah, but I would have to like watch a YouTube video. I have too big of an ego to just be like, hey, can you teach me a little bit? Yeah, it's like I'm fucking twenty years old. I shouldn't know how to roll. I don't know how to. I definitely don't. Though. I mean, legally, I shouldn't, but like legally, you should, yeah, whatever. 
So let's roll some sushi. Because we're healthy. <laughs> we're healthy. And we don't promote drugs here. <laughs> no. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so fun. I feel like I'm finger painting or something. <laughs> <laughs> enjoying this the way I do it. I don't know. No, it's a great, um, I'm glad it's sticking. It's just like a hobby, right? I know. I feel like it's gonna, like, just roll up. Yeah. <laughs> you like licking that sticky stuff on your fingers? Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> you like the sticky white free. stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if the rice is naturally sticky when it's done, or if I really did the right concoction of things. I feel like it's the con concoction of things. I did it good? Yeah, I feel like it's it is. I'm like shocked about it right now. It's like, did I do something good for once in my life? Stop it. Look at my hands. <laughs> this is how sticky it is. Just mine's fucked up. <laughs> Yours is right. Are you sure? Yeah, because No, like, you can bend it both ways. Yeah, but the vegetables are the wrong way. Look at yours. Oh, yours. I see what you're saying. So I gotta just... Wait, did I do it completely wrong? Or do I just need to move this that way? You think? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> or... Is it? Is it? But then... Oh my god, I fucked up <laughs> the whole thing. It's wrong, but whatever. No, it's fine. What? Right. It's fine. I <laughs> <laughs> like how you're trying to comfort me. Oh, maybe I did overfill this. Well, let's see. Is this what I'm supposed to do? And then you swallow it, right? Yeah. <laughs> Don't I'm try. You apply pressure, maybe? Yeah. I think I got it. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm scared too. <laughs> Is it gonna roll over? What? Is it just gonna roll over? I guess. <laughs> Michelin star sushi. Oh my god. Everyone. Oh my god. Did I do it? I think so. Mm -hmm. I'm happy. I can't believe it like is sticking together. No. Stop it. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> okay, now what? Excuse me. Excuse um, me. <laughs> you're supposed to wet your fingers and then do this to make it stick more, I think. This isn't hard. You know, I feel like a porn set is the only place where it's a bad thing when someone says this isn't hard. Like, <laughs> wet it with cold water, and then you cut it in half. I'm gonna fucking drill. I know. Will it stick? Jesus. Stop. Oh my god. Ah! Oh my god! Oh, it's so cute! What? Look at that! It's not falling out! What is this it's magic? Oh, it's so cute. Wow. Okay. I'm just cutting them to smaller slices. This is so cute. <laughs> we did it! <laughs> Yay! I feel like this is really enjoyable, but I would never do it alone. Yeah, but no, I agree. You have to find the right people that actually are into cooking. Like, yeah, it's hard to find people that would get excited about this and not like frustrated though. Yeah, that's fair. People do get really frustrated cooking. Yeah. Oh my god. Yay! Oh my god, we both made it's it. It's adorable. Look at my little sushi. It's so cute. They're like so perfect. I love it. They're so cute. What do you mean? Cause you're just like, oh, you didn't think we were gonna be able to do it. Oh, you <laughs> thought you were gonna look ugly. Like, Stop. you're just like so pure. I just love it. I'm just like, everything's Thanks. gonna suck. Everything's gonna go wrong. Oh. Like, I have the wrong mindset for life. It's okay. I, I honestly believe this sushi this. only works out because you're here. Oh. Like, it's just your 
sunshine and raised positivity. Oh, stop! You're so sweet! <laughs> Murdering my heart. That's <laughs> oh, so cute. Murder me. Just kidding. Thanks. Speaks like charge me. That is just kidding. true. <laughs> Probably true. Mm-hmm. Did you hear that? Yeah. Worst cooking memory. This oh, one's for you. Yeah, that's true. Um, when I was younger, I don't remember what age, I was cooking a loaf of something. I want to say it was like coffee cake or something. And I was being all bit like an adult, big person, even though I <laughs> was not. Right. And I misjudged and thought I could pick up the loaf of, out of the oven with just one oven mitt on. And then I picked it up. Oh, and like heavy. it was too heavy and then I picked it up with the other hand at the same time and then I got like a third degree burn and that's like the Did only you go time to the hospital? no well because I picked it up and then I like dropped it <laughs> that's so cute thank you what do we do <laughs> I think one of those are good one of them. Yeah. I feel like there's a bunch of different things in there. <laughs> that could be used. <laughs> Are we ready to eat? Yeah. Soy sauce in a shot glass. Johnny, good luck, I think. Thank you. Thank you, Johnny, if you left these in my bag for me. Because I only owned one shot glass. Rum chata Caribbean rum with real dairy cream. <laughs> that sounds awful. That does sound awful. Whatever the fuck that is. Okay. I just love everything you do. Like, <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so the only thing we don't have are chopsticks. It tastes like sushi. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yay! Oh my god! <laughs> Juiciest male talent you've ever had in your mouth. Tommy Gunn has a really big dick. Mmm, Tommy Gunn's good. Yeah. He's a sweetheart. Yeah, he's really nice. Kind of funny. I've just shot with so many people over the past, like, year and some. Mm -hmm. So, I have a couple answers. Eric John's one of my favorites because he's done more for me than, like, anybody. And he's just so talented and... He's always on point, always rock hard, always <laughs> comes when he's supposed to come. Yeah. Like, he can do it all. He can do anything. He can come on command, like, even without touching himself. He's like... Yeah. He totally has it down. And then there are, like, guys that can make me come, which is actually super okay. rare. Okay, I see. So rare. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and those guys would be Ricky Spanish, Cody Steele, mm -hmm. and Johnny Goodluck. But I have to give a shout-out to Marcus Dupree. Um... Because he's the only person who knows how to make me squirt. Tyler oh, Nixon nice. did it, but we don't know how. I don't know how to do it, but Marcus Dupree knows how to fucking do it. So that's impressive yeah. to me that he knows more about my body than I do. <laughs> is enough. We made vegan sushi. And if you want the recipe, go look at the description. It'll be there. I will link Mackenzie's social media below. That's it. I had so much fun. Yay. It tasted so good. Bye.